Oh, look, I've caught a flying saucer. Hmm, bright blue too. Glass. Well, no, it's not quite that. It's actually a turntable here. There's a lovely ball bearing race which allows you to turn this flying saucer. But there's something quite wonderful about this. It's got rheoscopic fluid, they call it. Fine micropower that makes wonderful effects. There's a filling point here, which I'll point out in a minute for the effect it produces. But if you spin this, this is what happens. And when you stop spinning it, that's what happens. Look at that. That does remind me of, I don't know, um, hurricanes over the Atlantic or Pacific Ocean. When you stop it there and look at the turbulence at the end of the filling point there on the edge of the thing. So some lovely effects there. In addition to that, there are some tiny little particles, like little needles inside. And we have to attract them with this thing here, which looks like a little chess pawn, because it's actually got a strong magnet on the base there. So we look somewhere down at the bottom here, usually on the edge, and see if we can get a whole lot of little particles. Uh, yes, there we are, we've got them there. Now we bring them into the middle and look, we can make all sorts of lovely patterns and whirls and ups and downs and that, and that, and what else. It's a lovely thing for drawing patterns, but so transient. Almost as soon as they've formed, they start decaying and move into something else. So a lot of fun with that, but the thing itself I enjoy most is the spinning bit. If I spin it and leave it a little bit longer, you see this blue line here slowly coming into the center. Stop it suddenly and it does that wonderful whirl. That's my favorite effect like that. So let it um, calm down a bit. When the flanks here die down, you do a little spin the other way and you get lovely deep spiral vortexes with mountains and valleys. Superb, isn't it? And this bit, when it comes into the center, reminds me perhaps of a, a black hole, do you think? Do you think this is a black hole? Well, it, <laughs> it's a blue hole, really, but... Mm. Wonderful piece of uh, scientific equipment which you can play with. And of course the fun of it is the patterns and walls it creates when you stop the spinning instantly, or even quite slowly. It still makes wonderful effects like that. The faster you spin it, almost the better it is. Wow, that's coming right into the middle there and it's stopping now. Whoa. Scientific magic.